everybody doing? It's Mufasa Smacks. Welcome to the Lion's Den. Alright, look. I'm not going to talk long because I've been holding off on this video all day today. And I've been working all day. I got back, showered, and now I'm here. So I'm not going to talk right now. We're going to get right into it. And then I'm not going to pause it. I'm going to go right through it. And then once we go all through it, once you watch this whole video, then we're going to talk. Then I'm going to give you my reaction. So let's get it. That's right. I'm talking about three division world champion Terrence Crawford. What will you be up against when As you see him fact, standing I am across the talk. other side of the <laughs> ring? Let's find out. Man, this you looks always fucking amazing, feel like dude. you have a chance at first against Terrence Crawford. Oh, he is a man. slow starter. Movement, Gives bro. away the early rounds typically, but that's yeah, because that's he is downloading the blueprint to win the fight. Always has that great footwork. The it's jabs in look a lot and out better, of danger bro. so the effortlessly. All, has always He's always been good at controlling the distance the and the pace. And he's always showing you different looks. Switches yeah. seamlessly from southpaw to orthodox Grisham. and back. And one of his best Amazing assets, ring man. IQ. He can outsmart you, and just like that, Beautiful he hook. can crack you when you least expect it. And now Terrence Crawford beginning to pick up the pace mm. and intensity, starting to land at will now. And once mm. he gets his opponents mm. in the corner, they very rarely get out unscathed. And he's the master yeah, at the catch the and shoot. And when he gets those hands going, they look like a blur. I like uh um, Crawford has your timing down. Yeah, I'll just talk about You're like later. a sitting duck. Look at him just working oh, it. Dude. Arguably the number one pound for pound fighter in the world. Imagine and there fighting Crawford in again. career mode, he man. He never stays in the pocket too that long. Even though he is a man. KO artist. 76% knockout him. ratio. The only man to stop Sean Porter. Now all those shots are starting to take a toll mm. on you. We're beginning to deteriorate. Throw. And Crawford smells blood. And we know what happens before. when he smells blood. He's 38 no with 29 knockouts. And he's coming to get you. Yeah, Especially this slow motion. It, it's a good indication what for a uh, big right. Okay, and then he's going crazy. Whoever he's edited that. Hands go, yeah. And you got no shot. You're in too deep. And it's all over. Mm. Bud Crawford finds oh. another victim right here on ESBC. Ooh. Well, we're out of time, and I'm out of breath. Think Stop, you have what bro. it takes Stop. to beat Bud Crawford? Find out on Esports Boxing Club. You damn right I'm gonna whoop his ass. The fuck? <laughs> what do you, what's Todd say? Esports here on ESBC. I'm definitely well, gonna whoop his ass. Well, we're out of time, and I'm definitely. out of breath. Think you have what it takes to beat Bud Crawford? Hell yeah, we finna whoop his ass. What are you talking about? Alright, let's go back. Oh shit, this is nice. Look at that. That's nice. Alright. I'm trying to gather myself. There's a, there's a lot going through my mind right now. A lot. A lot of excitement. And a lot of sadness. <laughs> sadness. Just for the simple fact that I just want to play this game already, dude. I just want to play this game already. That's all I want. That's all I want. It's funny too because I had a dream last night of this of this fucking game, and I don't think about I don't think about this game much anymore. I mean, I do, but you know, it's not consuming my day. But I had a dream of it last night, and it's supposed supposedly in my dream it was coming out July twenty eighth. Which is, it's it's just funny. It's just funny, but. Fucking. Yeah, man. This. This is. Everything I expected this game to be. And this is not even the finished product either. This is still alpha. They still, man, they still consider this alpha. This, they still consider this alpha. My bad, you guys might be here in my chair. But. Bro, this this is at least beta. This is definitely at least beta. Or whichever one goes fucking first. But Yeah, this is this is beautiful, man. That's right. I'm talking the about three division world champion Terrence Crawford. Gonna be amazing. What will you we we seen that already. Be up the lighting when you is, see him standing is across beautiful. the other side of the ring. Let um Kel Brook right here. I don't know what the hell happened to Kel Brook. I don't remember Kel Brook looking like this. Got Kenny Bayless over there looking, looking like Kenny Bayless. He, he looks just like himself. Let's find out. And this right here, this shot. We get to see what's going on at the judging table. They got the bell. Um, 
all their miscellaneous items on the on the uh, on the desk, and that we also get to see the coaches, the coaches, the uh, the ref, and we have a lot more action around the ring too, the cameraman. Everybody, this is this is beautiful. They did it right this time. This time they did it right because before, before it was empty, barren, no judging table, no nothing. So it gave the indication that they didn't have these things done. They didn't have these things um, in the game, which we've seen the judging table before. We've seen the crowd around the uh, around the ring. We've seen those things before. And in, in their past trailer, we didn't see none of it. We didn't see nothing. This time, they did it right. They showed, they had a, um, they had a good person using uh, Crawford, which was Boxing Fanatical, if people if people don't know. Boxing Fanatical uh, helped with this video, and I'm pretty sure he played the game too. I didn't watch his video. I just watched a little bit of it just to hear what he had to say about him being there. Um, just listen to him a little bit. Um, but yeah, they, they had a good guy playing. They had a really good fucking player playing the game. He was using distance, using movement, using the jab and showed boxing. That's what he showed. He showed boxing. And that's definitely what we needed. Definitely what we needed. Let's continue. You always feel like you have a chance at first. Oh man, that movement, man, that movement. He is movement. a slow starter. And you know what, dude? I forgot which one, which video it was, but they did say that we will be able to mix and match um, punches and movements. So you know, like a Muhammad Ali jab, and you have maybe a fucking Kell Brook hook, or what, or what, or whatever the case is. Whoever has the marquee movements. Um, and animations that we'll be able to mix and match those things. So we'll be able to pick individual animations to make our own, which is phenomenal. And looking at Gives this movement of Crawford, I might go that so route. Because he is but I, again, I gotta see Roy Jones and Ali and Always all these dudes. That, great footwork. Gets that jab is beautiful. He's danger. pumping out that jab, so moving around. He's always good at controlling the distance. That, that jab right there. Of danger, so I don't know what it is about that jab, but I fucking love this. It, it, it looks like a, a lazy. Danger, it looks like a lazy so jab. It just he's looks nice to controlling me. The it just looks the nice to me, and Arthur Gotti's movement is nice too. Switches seamlessly from southpaw to orthodox. Yeah, look at that southpaw orthodox bouncing around. Ring IQ. He can outsmart you, and just like that, he can crack you when you least expect it. And kudos to Todd Grisham, bro. I don't know, man. I heard, I I remember, um, I remember them saying that those gonna be two commentators, but I have yet to hear about this second commentator. I don't even know who the fuck it is. I, pfft. but either way, man, Todd Grisham, he's he's doing a good job, man. He's holding it down, and he finally, finally, hearing him talk and hearing how he's gonna commentate in the game. High quality, high fucking quality, bro. So he's doing amazing with this. And now Terrence Crawford beginning to pick up this the overhead view is really nice to land too. At will now. And once he gets I wonder if this is part of the cinematic they camera. Very rarely get out Those body shots are nice. Those hooks are nice. The... That was nice too. You saw that? Gets his opponents in the corner. They very rarely get out unscathed. So let's see it. Artur threw the jab. Wait, no, was that a right hand? I think that was a right hand. He gets the opponents in the corner. Mm, nice. They very rarely get out. Body, body. Head. Yep, he threw the right hand. And, he's and Crawford mad. threw the left hook and caught him. At the catch mm, but shoot. came in and ate and something too. Hands going, they look like Man, I would love blur. to see. Man, they should have had boxing fanatical fighting somebody because it looks like he might be down. using, uh, he might like be fighting a computer, bro. Look at him just working it. Arguably the number one pound for pound fighter it just in the world. It just there, looks and feels again. like it's a computer. He never stays in the pocket too long, even though he is a KO artist. 76% Ooh, yep, that was ratio. nice, dude. 
long. Even the better in the world, and there he starts. I want to see that again. I want to see it in slow mo. That's a nice jab. Jab. Body shot. Hook. Even though he jab. Body shot. Overhand. Uppercut. <laughs> and out of there. Ratio. The only man how uh, how big is quarter. it? That swim without getting wet. <laughs> fucking love that dude. This. This right here. Ooh, hold on. Do we see a, a cut under the eyes? Beginning to deteriorate. This right here. We get to see blood on the on the ring. And we get to see, we get to see blood on the on the uh on the glove. Now, for me, okay, the, these are the things I want because I want I want esports boxing club to show the beauty and the brutality of boxing. I, they already got the facial damage down. They got some disgusting cuts. And bruising and fucking swelling. It's crazy. It's crazy. But I want to see more blood flow. Like right here. Hold on. We're going to see it right now. There's blood on the canvas. And blood on Terrence Crawford's glove. But where's the blood on Arturo Gatti's face. Where his cut is. And also on his body. I want to see the blood flow. So if it's a big gash. I want to see that that blood dripping down on the face, dripping down to the shorts and to the chest. I would love to see that. And if we're caught in the clinch, if we clinch up, your blood can smear on me and smear on my clothes. I would love to see that. But so far for Alpha, this is amazing. Just fucking imagine what this game is going to be like when it fully drops. When basically they got... The foundation, the walls, and the roof built. And now they can start dealing with the interiors. So the interiors are, is already looking good. Everything's pff, everything's already good. They might they might even have a, the walls and the roof up already. They just need to work on the interiors. Basically, like, like um, the cuts. They still got to work on the career mode and shit like that. But all in all, man, this is this is looking beautiful. Rival. Um, boxing gloves. I wonder where their shoot where the shoes are, but you know, it's all good. It's alpha. I get it. Let's continue. And we know what happens. When that's, a, that's a nice blood. hook. That's a nice hook. You saw those two hooks. And we know what happens mm. when he smells And it sounds nice too. You, you hear it? Blood. And we know what happens when he smells blood. That's nice, bro. It's not like a crazy big thud. No, he he, he, he popped that hook out there. Beautiful. Now this right here with the slow motion and the transition, I don't really like it a lot. But it's fine. Mm. Oof. This shot right here, when he hits him with the hook, mm. it looks like it mixes. his, it looks like it, it mixes his jaw. Todd Grisham, you got no shot, you're in too deep. Mm. Pops his head up. It's crazy, dude. They did such an amazing job on this. And where did, where did, uh... Where did Kel Brook go? He got hit with that hook and he went flying off off screen damn near. Look, boom, got hit with the hook and damn near fell off screen. Mm. And look, just down. Just down for the count. And then look at the facial, the facial, uh, the reaction. The KO reaction of uh, Terrence Crawford. Yeah, I was like, yeah, motherfucker, yeah. Fucking love it, dude. Fucking love well, it. Well, we're out of time. I'm, and I'm, I'm out of... <sighs> Looks just like him, man. The graphics, everything is on you point, man. You have what it man. takes to beat Bud Crawford?
And again, definitely got what it takes to be Bud Crawford. Once I get into this career mode, I'm either doing welterweight, and you guys are gonna see this too, because I'm definitely gonna do um a playthrough of of the career mode. I'm definitely gonna do that. I'm shit. I might do that a couple times, and I'm gonna definitely do some online gameplay too. I'm just waiting. For, obviously, we need to wait for all this shit to come out first. But gives away the all in all, man, amazing job by Boxing Fanatical and amazing job by Still City Interactive. We get to see everything that we've been wanting to see from this game. We want to see the the referee. We want, we want to see the judges. We wanted to see Terrence Crawford. Um, we wanted to see the improvements that they made when it comes to uh, boxing animations, when it comes to the movement, when it comes to the lighting and the uh, character models. Look at that. They're not even... They're not shiny like they were before. They're not. They, they fixed it. They fixed it all. They fixed it all. The punches even look better. The jabs look better. The body shots look better. And this overhead view captured the, uh, capture that. Captures them. Sorry. Look at the look at the foot placements. The foot placements. It's dude. It's crazy. We get to see where the shots are going, and we get to see where the foot placement is. It's it's beautiful. It's it's such a beautiful game. And I can't wait to fucking play it. I hope that they tell us something soon. I really do, man, because I'm still hyped for this game, man. I really want I, I really want to play this game. It's just damn man, I, I I'm 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 still hyped. I'm I'm cooling down a little bit, looking for news and shit. But now it's just alright, you showed us the graphics, you showed us this amazing gameplay. Everybody seems like they're loving it. I'm, I I looked on Twitter. Everybody seems like they're loving it. What's the release date? This looks good. I'll play this shit. I'll play it. What's what's the what's the next move? More gameplay, more you know, more fucking character models, which I'm all cool with. I'm cool with the, all of that. I am. But damn, man, I I want this game, bro. Or at least give us a release date. But yeah, man. Other than that, man, this is all I have for you. I'm gonna go and eat. I'm fucking starving. I just want to get this video out there. I've been waiting all damn day. Um, but yeah, man. This is pretty much this is pretty much all I got. I'm honestly gonna watch this video. I mean, I'm gonna watch. Yeah, I'm gonna watch this video so many times, bro. And then I'll get back to you guys again. I might. I might. I might do a better breakdown but other than that bro this is all this is all i have for you ain't shit else out there there's nothing else we got these these Taren, uh these terrence crawford screenshots we got these boom looks amazing looks just like them what's next steel city what's next we need to know what's next and I bet y'all any money that y'all told Boxing Fanatical the potential release date. I bet y'all did. But whatever, man. This was awesome. This was awesome. The catch and shoot. And when he gets those hands going, they look like a blur. I can't wait. The Crawford has your time. Man, hold on. Give us hey, give us some Canelo gameplay, bro. Where's the Canelo gameplay? I, that bet, man, that needs to be the the next gameplay. We need to see Canelo Alvarez and Roy Jones fighting something. Give us, give us those two. Give us those two. I definitely want to see those two motherfuckers fighting, and put Boxing Fanatical back in it too. Bring him, fly him out. Do what y'all gotta do. Do a Boxing Fanatical versus Study or, or versus Biz. Cause pff, shit, Boxing Fanatical and Biz, bro. One person uses Roy Jones, the other person uses Canelo. Man, let them let let them do their thing, man. Let them play a twelve rounder and let them edit it and let them both release it. Let them do that. That shit will be fucking a one. But yeah, this is all I got for you guys. And peace.